Drag shows are a trend that has been on the rise lately. Soon, on this campus, a drag show will be occurring. While most are either supportive or indifferent, there is one group that, for whatever reason, is extremely opposed and began protesting. We set out today to speak to those people and learn why they are so against this and what inspired them to stand up against the tyranny that is men dressing up as women. Hell no, we won't go. Hell no, we won't go. Hell no, we won't go. What's up, my name is Michael. I'm the president here of uh, Gamma Alpha Epsilon on campus. It's a Christian uh, fraternity. We're also conservative, you know. We've been, uh, we've been out here since 81 denouncing drag shows. You know, that's kind of what we're all about here. What are my beliefs? <laughs> yeah, I would probably consider myself an economic liberal and a uh, social conservative. I watch the Joe Rogan podcast, so I think I know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I'm just really worried about the kids whenever they see stuff like this because, you know, I like I get like they see people in like kid shows dress up in drag all the time, like the men dress up as skirts and stuff, but like it's supposed to be funny because they're sad, you know? Like I'm sad all the time. Like it's not, it's not, I, it shouldn't be happy. Yeah, I don't really give a shit about any of this. I just came because uh, all my Gamma Alpha Epsilon bros tell me they think I'm gay because of the way I dress. And I'm like, it's a Hawaiian shirt. Grass skirts are like the traditional dress, man. Bro, I keep telling Joe not to show up in that kind of fashion. It's throwing off the vibe here. Yeah, man. Jimmy Buffett wears Hawaiian shirts all the time, and he's not gay. I checked this morning, man. I'm sure. What do we want? Drag. drag. When do we want it? We, we don't. We don't. I don't like drag because it's overly sexualized, you know? It incites feeling in men that I don't think men should have or should want to deal with. It makes me upset. I just don't want to be attracted to men when they put on dresses, you know? It, it's really hard. Oh, and it, like, oppresses women or something, too. Yeah, man, I don't even... Yeah, they just handed this to me when I got here. Uh, I don't even know what it's supposed to be. It says like, drag no, and then somebody got like a third grader to draw a scaly dick on here. Yeah, so our campaign we're doing today is uh, drag no, because you, you see the dragon here. We took the O in and drag it, and then switched it to no, because of dr no drag. I drew this dragon here in Photoshop. It took me about three hours. I was trying to think of a logo, something that would make people not like drag, basically. And that, this is kind of like what I came up with. This is what people think when they don't want drag. So that's basically what we're saying with this entire campaign. You know, except everything else, but basically that. Guys, stop the drag race on campus. Take my flyer. Good. Take my flyer. My name is Jebediah. I'm a biblical studies major with a focus on Leviticus, my favorite book in the Bible. These drag shows are a front to the conservative values the A&M was built on. This is the equivalent of murder in the eyes of God. You know, if we allow these things to continue, A&M is going to be smited like Sodom and Gomorrah. Yeah, man, that Bible guy's weird as hell. Look, everybody, it's my wig because I'm a drag queen. <laughs> that's funny because that's, really that's not what men do. Look, everybody, I'm wearing my wig because I'm a drag queen. <laughs> I'm a work it because I am a diva. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Hey, Michael, I think you're getting a little bit too into this. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna bust it down because I'm a draggy. So we created a new offshoot of protesters called Flaps to reduce the amount of drag that we had in our past program. And uh, I think it's really coming together. Yeah, you know, I'm fine with freedom of speech. I just don't want it out in the open. You know it's going to be in a closed off area inside, right? There's not going to be anything in public. You have to pay to go. Wait, wait, wait what? 